Bitcoin mining can be profitable, complicated, and even controversial. In 2025, it's still possible to earn rewards through mining, but the game has changed. Here's everything you need to know before you start. But before we jump into this video, I just want to mention that Coinly assesses this topic based on publicly available information. Any information is accurate at the time of recording. This is not an endorsement of any specific provider, service, or strategy. It is not a recommendation to trade, mine, or invest. Users should still carry out due diligence and seek professional tax advice before making any decisions. Mining is what powers proof-of-work blockchains like Bitcoin. It's how transactions get verified, how new coins are created, and how the network stays secure. But mining isn't as simple as plugging in your PC anymore. Let's break it down. What is Bitcoin mining? The process of validating transactions and adding them to the blockchain. It's done by solving complex mathematical puzzles called proof of work. Rewards are given in new Bitcoins plus transaction fees. It's critical for maintaining the decentralized network. Okay, that's all fine and dandy Nelly, but what do you need to start? Well, for starters, you need a powerful computer, ideally an ASIC mining rig, a stable, low cost power supply, electricity costs can make or break profitability. You also need mining software such as CG Miner or BFG Miner or Awesome Miner. Optionally, you can join a mining pool for consistent rewards. If you'd like to learn more about the best Bitcoin mining software, check out our page and subscribe because we've got more content about this topic in the works. Okay, with that out of the way, let's jump into some pros and cons of mining. Starting off with the pros, potential profit if Bitcoin's price rises. It supports decentralization and network security. There are opportunities for innovation in hardware and energy efficiency. Okay, let's talk about the cons. Well, it's a high energy consumption event and its environmental impact is not small. It's expensive and you need specialized hardware. There is constant increasing competition from large mining farms. There's also regulatory risks in some countries. There are other options or other coins you can mine. So you can also mine Litecoin, Dogecoin, Bitcoin Cash, Ethereum Classic. All use proof of work, but difficulty and profitability do vary. And another note here, if you'd like to learn more about the best cryptos to mine for this year, we made a video on that, which I will leave down below. All right, let's talk about taxes on mining. In many countries, mining rewards are treated as income at the time you receive them. Later, when you sell your mine coins, you also owe capital gains tax. Using a crypto tax calculator like Coinly makes it easier to track both. Okay, final tip here. There's still over 1.5 million Bitcoins left, but profitability will mostly depend on what your costs end up being, your setup, and your location. Always calculate your break-even point before you start. Mining isn't for everyone, but if you have the right setup, low electricity costs, and patience, it can still be worthwhile. And just remember to track your rewards and taxes with tools like Coinly to avoid surprises at tax time. And lastly, information on this subject is always changing. So be sure to check out our blog that's regularly updated by our content team for the latest information. If you enjoyed this video, consider dropping a like, subscribing for more crypto content, and I'll see you next time. Peace.